Hello my loves, this is Try With Malia and today we are going to be doing my holiday gift guide part one. So let's get started. Okay, so pretty much I'm going to be showing you 20 items that I am gifting this holiday season. This is part one of four. So make sure you tune in for this part two, part three, and part four as well. But okay, we're gonna get started with our first product. I am gonna leave the prices that I paid for these items, but I did get a lot of these items on Black Friday deals, so I might have gotten them cheaper than what they might be now. But I will be linking everything in order down below in my description, so you can go and check if prices have changed or if they're still the same, or if it's something that you're interested in. Also, these are gifts, so I don't really want to open everything and mess everything up, but if I can open it and show you guys a close-up look, I will. But I will be inserting pictures of the items right here in case you guys want to see what they're made of and stuff. But okay, let's get started with the first product. And I think I can open this one up. Yes, I can. So our first product is the Coach Beanie, and I got this for $38.40. And it is this black wool merino beanie. And it is the cutest thing. It has like the little C right here, if you can tell. And let's see. This says it's 100% wool with the leather trim. So it's wool and leather right here. This is a gift for an older guy that's in his 50s. Um, I wasn't really sure what to gift him, but they are from Mexico. And so they're really not used to like the Texas weather here. So I decided to gear him and his wife with some nice winter accessories. So I feel like this is going to be a really good gift really for anybody. And it's made out of wool, so it's supposed to keep your head warm. Okay, my next product is a coach scarf and I paid $53.40 for this. Now, right here it says comparable value to $178, but honestly, I don't think it was that much. I ended up getting both of these products at the coach outlet, which they usually have way cheaper prices there than at regular coach so i would look there first and see if you find anything that you like at the coach outlet and if not then you can purchase it at regular coach okay and this is what the scarf looks like it's like a black scarf with the coach logo on it it is so beautiful it is so soft and i really hope that she loves it and this scarf is 85 percent wool and 15 percent silk so this should keep her warm as well and it's so beautiful i love this scarf so much and i'm just taking off the price tags now that i'm here because after i film this video i am gonna start wrapping presents up because they've been sitting <laughs> They've been sitting in my bedroom and my bedroom has been looking a hot mess. Okay, the third item on my list, this is for my brother-in-law and his wife. We actually ended up gifting them a massage gift card or like a massage certificate since it's going to be the perfect amount they can use for a one hour massage. So they can either go at different times or they can do a couple's massage and it's like a little getaway for them. My husband has a membership at Hand and Stone. So he's been going for like three months to get his, uh, Monday. Es que, bueno, ahorita estoy um, haciendo un video. ¿Quieres que lo hagamos juntas en la, cuando llegues a la casa? Okay. Okay. Bye. Bye. Okay, I got a phone call, you guys, and I don't remember what I was saying, but my husband has a membership at Hand and Stone. He's been going there for around three or four months now, and he loves it. So if you have happen to have a membership there or any, like, massage institutes, I would check with them and see if they're offering any deals on gift cards. We actually ended up getting a deal if we bought two one-hour massage or no, if we bought two gift cards, we got a free massage. 
So we have three massages in total for the price of two, which I thought that was a great deal. He ended up paying 140 because it was buy two, get one. So 140 for three people to get a one hour massage. I think that is such a great deal. And honestly, a massage is something that people don't really do for themselves, but they should. I used to be a massage therapist and I don't know, I would highly recommend everybody to go get a massage at least once in their life. It will literally change your life. <laughs> but okay, let's move on to the fourth product. Okay, this next product is for a teenager. She's in high school. I believe she's a sophomore. And I am got her her first pair of Victoria's Secret PJs, which I paid $42 for. These were on sale. I think they're normally like... 60 something so i would just grab these when they're on sale honestly okay yeah so normally these are priced at 69.95 and let's see the material it doesn't say what material this is but this is the moto long long pj set and i got it in this like black with i think it's like a pink liner it is so 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 cute and I think she's gonna love her new PJs. I won't open them for you, but again, I'll be showing pictures of what the PJs actually look like because I want them to receive their gifts in, I don't know, folded up. And I know I'm not gonna do a great job at folding this back up. <laughs> oh, okay, here it is. Oh, okay, so I don't know how you pronounce that. Moda, Moda is a type of fabric. So it's 90% Moda and 10% Elastane. And it's like a very like soft, cool to the touch fabric. It feels really nice. I really hope that she loves her new PJs. When I was younger, I was obsessed with Victoria's Secret, which I don't know, there was something about it. Um, it's probably not the best quality of stuff, but I loved it so much. I would watch the fashion show every single year and I always had to have like whatever fashion show like collection they had i had to own at least one thing from their collection it was insane but okay another gift for her it's actually like a little extra gift for her like a little stocking stuffer is gonna be this victoria's secret bombshell spray and this one was nine dollars i am obsessed to this day with this scent and now if you go into their site they have so many different bombshell like perfume scents but i just stuck with the original and i just got her this little perfume scent in case she doesn't like it you know it's small enough to where if she doesn't like it she can gift it to somebody else or i don't know um give it back to me no she probably wouldn't do that but uh, this smells so nice i actually ended up buying myself the hand lotion and I got her the perfume. I just love this scent so much. It's very like nostalgic. So I don't know, kids these days, they're into the brands now, they're different. So hopefully she likes the scent. I will probably do another video for you guys to see if they liked their gifts or not but I mean it's gonna be until after Christmas okay this next gift is a little bit more expensive this was a hundred and five dollars and that is the price this one was not on sale and I got this one for my husband I have yet to see how this dif differs how this differ how this is different than the actual perfume but i got him the baccarat rouge 540 um body oil i believe the perfume itself is like 300 or 400 dollars and i don't have that kind of money to spend on a perfume so i was looking at dupes and i almost bought him the dossier dupe and there's like a few dupes that they have so i almost got him one of those but then I went to Neiman Marcus and I saw that they had the body oil and I think that they also have a hair mist in this collection. And it's like not cheap, but it's not as expensive. Like I mentioned, it's $105 for this. 
So I'm gonna let him open this on Christmas and then I will report back like how good this smells like does it stay can you can other people smell it I don't know I have so many questions and I'm excited for him to try this body oil this next gift is a pocket drone and this was $29.99 and this is what the packaging looks like I'm not gonna open this one up because I don't even know if I'm gonna need to like if it's like I I don't know I just don't know what's in this box like I don't know if you have to put it together if there's little pieces that might get lost so I'm gonna keep it on here I'll try to show a video if not I'll just show you the picture but in the link down below if you it's gonna be number seven if you go to amazon they have reviews of how this thing moves around and there was one video in particular where these dogs are chasing it and that i was sold so i got this for my nephew he is nine years old so i really hope that he loves this drone again i will let you know how well it works for us because Maybe the video was for a different drone. I don't know. I'll let you know. <laughs> this next gift, number eight, is a Psycho Bunny polo shirt. And I paid $80.50. I think that wasn't a Black Friday deal. I think that was just like the regular price. I'm not sure. If it's not, then it was like $110. But I think if you sign up, you get like a first time discount like a 10% discount I'm not really sure but I paid $80.50 and this is what the shirt looks like it's like a taupe color uh polo shirt and he doesn't really have that many like dress up shirts because we sort of kind of cleared out our closets and gave a lot of stuff away and so now we're trying to revamp his closet into something that fits his style now. So I really like this polo. Um, it says it's 100% Peruvian cotton, if I'm not mistaken. So we'll see if he likes this or not. I will let you guys know. And this is the Santa Fe Peak Polo. We got it in a size 7, aka size XL. And let me just get a peek at what the material feels like. It feels very thick. Like a good quality shirt. I don't know. I'm excited to give this to him. I really hope that he likes it. Okay, next up on my list is a power bank. I got this power bank for $36.99 on Amazon. I got this one for my mom because she actually stole one of our power banks, which is not a big deal. Yeah, because we have another power bank. But I decided to get her her own power bank so she doesn't have to like, we don't have to be going like back and forth with power banks, you know, she can have her own. So I got her this ultra bright flashlight edition portable power bank. It's, it's supposed to be able to charge her phone and she can also use this as a flashlight in case she needs to use it as a flashlight. So I thought this was really cool. It says it has overcharge protection, overpower protection, restore protection, short circuit protection, high temperature protection. So this is supposed to be like a high quality power bank and it's supposed to be able to charge like any of your electronics including your ipads your cell phones your games and more so i think i can open this one since it's for my mom and i was kind of surprised at how heavy this power bank is like i don't think our other power banks are as heavy ah <laughs> that blinded me and that's like a pretty, pretty bright flashlight. That's pretty cool. Okay. And it has, it has two different adapters. It has the USB-C and the, the old iPhone adapter. So I don't think this is going to be compatible with like the regular adapter, but it also comes with this USB and USB-C inputs outputs so you can like plug in your own charger in case one of the chargers that's attached doesn't fit 
so i hope that she likes this gift <laughs> and i actually after i bought this one i got a lot of ads of, of power banks on amazon and i ended up finding another another two that i really like so i will be posting them right here one of them is a solar power bank which charges with the sun so i thought that was really cool and it even comes with like a little key fob looking thing to charge your apple watch so i might gift that one for my husband as well because he's out in the sun every day so like he could be charging it while he's like working he can just leave it outside so i might get him that one i'm not sure there's a few that i have in mind and this one in particular i feel like i might get him that one okay number 10 is a heated fleece jacket and i paid 120 dollars for this jacket this was on sale on amazon but i believe it's like 150 regular price and that is a normal price to pay for a heated jacket i myself have a heated jacket and that's how much i ended up paying for mine but this one is a different brand this is deb bu do bu and this is a fleece jacket i have like a like the north face material kind of jacket but anyways it's the jacket and it also comes with the battery always make sure that if you're buying a jacket like make sure that it comes with a battery because sometimes they offer a cheaper alternative without a battery so that's where they get you so this is actually for my mom she gets very cold inside the house and i get very hot especially on days that i'm recording and so she has her own little personal heater that she turns on so I feel like this is going to be a little nice addition to her if she gets cold. She can just throw on her heated jacket and it's a fleece jacket so it's not bulky and she can wear it around the house. But yeah, I'm so excited for her to open this. I kind of want to give it to her before Christmas. Should I give it to her before Christmas or should I wait? I don't know. But yeah, they also have hard shell. Okay, so this is a fleece one and then they also have the hard shell in case you're wanting it you're wanting to buy it for someone that like works outdoors i think that would be such a really good gift or someone just in general that's like that lives through the cold the cold winters uh texas starts to get pretty cold january february so i feel like even if you wait till christmas to gift this to someone they're still going to use it like two or three months afterwards okay this next gift it's a legendary white tails jacket and i paid 47.99 for this this was on sale it's originally it doesn't say but it was on sale and i'm not gonna open it all the way because i love how it's like folded but this is what the jacket looks like it is a very like thick material it has like a soft lining inside and it's like flannel outside it's like a jacket slash flannel i love this one for him i think he's really gonna love this plaid jacket i always see him in plaid so this is gonna be for my sister-in-law's husband and i really hope that he likes it they also sent me a like a shopping booklet and oh my gosh a lot of their clothes is really cute so make sure to check out legendary whitetails if your husband or someone you know is very like country or like very texan i'm sure they would love this brand okay this next gift is actually one of our white elephant gifts we are bringing three but two of them well, one of them's not here yet, and the other one we haven't picked exactly what it's going to be. But this is a tortilla blanket, and we got this one on Amazon for $15. So I'm actually going to open this one. Because I think this is so funny. Oh my gosh, I can't open it. Okay, anyways, it's a tortilla blanket. And it even comes with a tortilla sleep mask. I'll show a picture here of what the blanket looks like. They had different ones. They even had like different like burnt tortillas. Like they had yellow tortillas, white tortillas. Some were more burnt tortillas. 
They even had like a donut. But yeah, they had so many crazy designs. Uh, we just thought their tortilla was the funniest. And it's a funny product, but like you can still use it. So I hope that everyone loves this tortilla blanket. And I'm so excited to see who's going to get it and what their reaction is going to be. <laughs> okay, now we are moving on to gifts that I actually bought for myself. <laughs> <laughs> but I think that would be great gifts to give to other people and with number 13 we start with the sleep cloud weighted pillow and this was $45 I bought this on Amazon and actually there wasn't that many reviews for this pillow so I was like not really sure what I was gonna get but this is what the pillow looks like and it's like kind of heavy on both sides and like there's nothing in the middle but i love this pillow it's been a week since i have it and it's been a game changer i do sleep on my side and i do sleep uh facing up and i've noticed that when i sleep on my side i just hug it and it makes me fall asleep so quick or sometimes I just like put it on top and I just like hug it and that pressure of like the weight of the pillow, it just knocks me out. I love it so much. So if you know a side sleeper that has a hard time sleeping or like is an overthinker at night, I would highly suggest this pillow and I think they would absolutely love it. Okay, in the same realm as for sleeping, we got these non-pod sleep masks for $27. I also purchased this on Amazon. This says, is the three minute magic. It says, give non-pod three minutes and you'll never sleep the same. When gentle pressure is applied to the body, it has a natural calming effect. The science behind this is known as deep touch pressure, but you'll think it's magic. This is what the sleep mask looks like. And it has like four little like spaces because you can use it while you're facing up. So you can use it like this. Or if you're sleeping on your side, you're supposed to use like the edge. So like if I'm going to sleep this way, I'll use this edge and then like have this put pressure on this side of my head. And it's supposed to help you fall asleep. And the reason it doesn't like attach is because you're not supposed to keep it on all night. It says that it should naturally like fall off your face and because it's just supposed to help you sleep. But in case you did want to like attach it to your face, it has this little, little tiny hole that you would put this sleeve through. I haven't tried to do that yet, but it says it'll, well here. <laughs> ah, okay, there we go. It went in. So it works. So if you want to attach it to your head, you can. I haven't. I just have been like, um, ah, now I can't take it out. Ah, okay, there we go. I just been putting this on my eyes and I'm actually using this one to meditate. I haven't used it to sleep yet. But anyways, I use this to meditate. So during the day when it's like, uh, when it's still bright outside and you want to meditate or you want to just like relax for a little bit and close your eyes, this feels really good on your eyes it also has like a cooling effect it has like a cooling side and then it also has like a fleece side in case you want like warmth so that'll be up to you how you want to wear it but yeah i love this sleep mask and i feel like this would be such a gift for really anybody for any ages it's just perfect my next product I actually bought this before it went viral on TikTok, um, which is pretty cool that it went viral on TikTok. It is this face neck massager and I paid $20.99 for this. So basically what it is, you just turn it on and you just lift up and massage and it's supposed to help with like drainage. It's supposed to help with like um, lifting your face or 
if you want to like clean your fi face it has like a setting for that i don't know there's like seven colors i think and all seven colors do different things so i'll link it for you guys i bought this on amazon and amazon kind of gives you a better understanding of how this works but i love it honestly i don't know like i haven't tested it to the point where like i can see like a difference in like my face lifting but i can definitely feel like it's helping me like with lymph drainage i love it i love it so much and it feels so good and it has like a cooling effect so it feels good when you're like doing this at night love it love it love it okay this next product is my favorite men's perfume and this is gonna have to be the one million lucky by paco Rabanne. i purchased this for my husband i spent hours and hours and hours at ulta smelling perfumes and the moment i smelled this perfume it was like that's it I'll leave the notes here and how much I paid at Ulta because honestly, I don't remember. I think I bought this one last year. And like he uses it like almost every weekend and it's like he only needs like one or two sprays and you can just smell this. Ah, it smells so good. Anyways, so yes, I love it. If you want to smell it before you purchase it, I would recommend going to Ulta. They do have testers there that you can smell. So maybe go and do that and um i know right now ulta is doing like if you buy a fragrance you get a blanket or a robe for free so that's something to think about if you're gonna buy a gift this season and my set and my favorite favorite all-time perfume for women for myself personally is this ysl libre perfume this perfume smells sweet and romantic at the same time it i don't think it's like an everyday perfume but honestly like no matter what i'm doing i will wear this perfume but this is more like a going out to dinner perfume it's more like a night perfume more like a an event perfume it kind of feels like that but honestly i don't care i wear this whenever i want because I just love the way this smells. It smells so rich and so decadent and so romantic. And I just love everything about this perfume. But if you're looking for something more of like an everyday wear, I suggest the Marc Jacobs Perfect Perfume. I honestly don't even know what the notes are in this perfume. I'll again put them here and put the price of this perfume. Ah, but this perfume just smells like nothing I've ever smelled. It smells so playful, so fresh, kind of fruity in a way. Ah, I just love the way this smells. And I actually ended up getting this little perfume with the Marc Jacobs Daisy perfume in a little gift set at Ulta. So if you like the way this smells, you could always gift that little uh perfume set and i mean who doesn't want tiny bottles of perfume in their closet i am obsessed with tiny bottles i might say i feel like they don't smell the same like right away i can smell the alcohol in this as opposed to getting like the actual big bottle of perfume but it's just so cute i just can't help myself when i see a miniature size the bottle of perfume i have to get it and if you want to find out what other perfumes i have because i have many let me know and i will i will show you guys but okay we're reaching the end with three more products this next product i got on tiktok shop and i know let me show you guys okay <laughs> I got these boots on TikTok shop. Can you guys believe it? I paid a total of $12.93, I think. And that was with shipping included. Like that was my total. And surprisingly, they are here. And look at how cute these boots look. I got a size nine. They fit true to size. The only complaint I have is that they smell like glue or like chemicals, but you know, I've been letting them air out before I use them. And I purchased these, I think like at the beginning of November and then November 22nd or something, 
they stopped tracking. I said, oh my gosh, um, they're not gonna get here. But then randomly, this box showed up to my house. I had forgotten about it. I just, you know, I, I was like, they're gonna be lost. And they showed up. But before that happened, I really wanted these boots. And like I said, I had already thought they were lost. So I ordered some on Timu. They were a little bit more expensive. I think they were 20, but then they went, they dropped. So they gave me a credit. So I think I ended up paying $15 for those. So I'm gonna see if they're the same shoe. So I don't know if I can um, link these from the TikTok shop. Honestly, I'm not really sure. But if I can link the Timu ones, I will do so. But look at how cute these are. I'm obsessed. And they had these and the black ones, but I had to get these because I normally get black ones. Okay, and this next product, I've actually been sitting on it. Let me get it. And it is my very own first purchase from Barefoot Dreams. And it is their Safari Blanket. And this is what it looks like. It's like a one person blanket for sure. Like if I put it on the ground, let's see. Yeah, it's like as tall as me and I am like 5'5". Five five. So this definitely fits one person. And I think their the sale is still going on, so I will link it. The Safari blanket in general was $56. I just could not believe it because I saw the other blankets and they were like over $100. So I don't know if they're getting rid of this design or what. I'm not sure. I don't know if the other blankets are just bigger. I don't know. But when I saw that they had this one for $56, I had to get it. And I hope that it's still on sale so you guys can get it because... I thought people were being like a little bit overreacting when they were saying that this is one of the softest blankets that they own. This is one of the softest blankets I currently own. So I love it so much. My husband loved it so much and now we fight over it. So now I have to get another one. But anyways, what a cute gift for like a teen. I'm pretty sure your teens would go crazy for this blanket. Okay, and we reached the end to our last product, and this is falling off. The last, last product for this gift guide, but don't forget, I have part two, part three, and part four coming up next, but this is the last product for now, and it is a candle. Now, I don't know what generation Kindle I have. I'm pretty sure I have like one of the most basic Kindles, but even this on Amazon is like over $70. I don't know. I'll link the Amazon one, but then I'll also link the eBay one. So I got a refurbished Kindle and I only paid $50. And I remember like it was prime days and the candles were on sale. I even got it cheaper than that. So I paid $50 for this refurbished Kindle on eBay. And you guys, it works great. I, have, I haven't had any troubles with it, fortunately. But you know, that's like at your own risk, which I understood that. So I will link the Amazon Kindle and I will also link the one I got and you guys can figure out which one you want to buy if this is something that you're interested in but highly recommend it if you want to if you personally want to get into reading if you want your kids to get into reading if you know someone that loves reading this is such a great investment so you don't have to purchase the gift the books you can actually download hoopla i think there's hoopla libby and something else but they're like third-party softwares applications for your libraries where you can get you can rent out library books you do need a library card but nowadays you can get a library card from your library online all you need is like your address and your information and they send you like your library code and library number and then you put that into the Libby 
for the Hoopla app. And then you can start um, renting out get, uh, renting out books and even audiobooks. It's amazing. I have it. I have it. And I also have the Kindle Unlimited subscription. It's like a monthly thing where you get like to read a book for free every month. I'm not sure how it works, but I have both because there are some books that you can't find um, in the library app. And so those I've actually just like purchased outside or now that I have the Kindle Unlimited, I can just look them up there. But it has been life changing because I used to get paperback books and then I was reading them at night and then you know, you have to like put a little lamp and you can't read while you're laying down. And so now I can read while I'm like laying sideways and it's been a game changer. I try to read not every night, but I try to read at least once a week. But there are weeks where I will read like four days and then no days the next week. I don't know, but it has kept me like more actively reading and I love that. So yes, highly recommend a Kindle. But yes, that was it for this holiday haul. I don't know how long this was, but I hope this gave you some ideas to the, some of the stuff that you can gift to your family members. If there's anything that you're gonna gift in this list, please let me know down below. I just wanna see what you guys are gifting this holiday season. My part two is also gifts that I'm gifting. And then I will be doing gifts for like people that like to work out or that are like health conscious or that want like a spa day at home. That's gonna be part three. And then I am also gonna do like beauty and skincare and like hair products in another gift card. Cause you know, there's so many of those, they had to have their own video. But yes, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. I love you guys so much, and I will see you on the next one. Adios!